And now, please rise for the pledge to our flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Who's Masala? This guy even looks good in pink. Support Cancer Awareness Month. Get your pink Churchill vs. Cancer shirt every day at lunch in the school store. All proceeds go to the Leukemia Lymphoma Society. Get pink. All the cool kids are doing it. Hi there, Churchill students and parents. I'm Brianna Burke, your SGA president. The week of homecoming is by far one of the best weeks here at Churchill. If you're wondering what this week has in store or how you can participate, don't worry because my fellow officers and I are here to give you an overview of homecoming 2012. One competition between the classes will take place the week prior to Spirit Week as well as throughout the week leading up to homecoming. Starting on Monday, October 8th, classes will participate in a coin war. The coin war is a fundraiser between the four classes in which half the proceeds go to the winning class and the other half goes to Pennies for Patients, which is part of the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. The objective of the coin war is to get as much money into your own class's jars, which your class officers will be carrying throughout the day. The class with the highest total of money raised will be the winners. Spirit Week kicks off Monday the 15th with Retro Day. Crank out your hippie glasses and wipe the dust off those go-go boots because this day is a blast from the past. I know Zach will be wearing his poodle skirt. Then join us in the auditorium Monday night at 7 p.m. for Monday Night Mayhem, a series of competitions between the four classes. Monday Night Mayhem will consist of events such as a human relay race, human anagrams, and many games from NBC's TV show A Minute to Win It. Come out to support your friends as they compete against the other four classes and make fools of themselves. Homecoming tickets this year are only $30. You must have all your obligations cleared before you can buy one. Homecoming tickets are sold every day during lunch outside the cafeteria. Look for the signs. Freshmen and sophomores, you've got one line. Juniors and seniors, you've got another. Tuesday is Wacky Day here at Churchill. Make sure to bring in your most appropriate crazy clothes. And then come to the lower gym at lunch on Tuesday for more competitions between the classes. There will be awesome events such as the Milk Chug and the Bat Spin Relay taking place. On Wednesday, in honor of the PSATs, we'll be having Pajama Day. Come to school in your comfiest clothes. I expect to see people wearing footsies. And finally, Thursday's holiday dress-up day. Every class should make sure they dress up as their theme. Freshmen, you have New Year's. Sophomore, Valentine's Day. Juniors, 4th of July. And seniors, you have Halloween. Be sure to dress up and represent your class. Also on Thursday, the annual homecoming pep rally will take place at the stadium. Continuing right after school, everyone is encouraged to come out to help their class decorate the class floats that will be displayed at the homecoming game on Friday, October 19th. Make sure you get to the game early because performances will start at 5.30. Homecoming week will end Saturday night with our homecoming dance. The theme this year is a Halloween masquerade, which means that students should finish their elegant outfits off with a mask of any sort. Doors will open at 8 and close at 9.30. And that is your homecoming week in a nutshell, Churchill. We hope to see you all there getting involved. Go Bulldogs! Here's Masala. He's got so many t-shirts. But to get Blake to go to homecoming, he needed to change his shirt. Hey Hughes. What's good, Maggie? How many shirts do you have? I got all the shirts. Get your long sleeve shirt for the homecoming game outside the cafeteria at lunch and save your swag.